right, welcome back to Old Man Tech. Today we're going to be installing Cody on our Amazon Fire Stick. A um, couple little settings you got to do beforehand, um, like change. You want to be able to see hidden files and that kind of thing. So let's go ahead and make those changes. Um, I, I made nothing, no changes at all to my um, Amazon Fire Stick except for I did a factory reset. And then I added my account to it, of course. And I accidently, didn't mean to, but I clicked on the, uh, the Plex install from the cloud uh, in apps. Didn't mean to, but uh, you know, I went down here, accidentally went to the cloud there and installed it. Didn't mean to, but uh, anyway. So let's go ahead and go down to settings because that's some of the things we want to do first before trying to install it. So go to settings, go over to system, and in system there's a couple things we want to change. Um, here in the developer options, okay, select that and there's two things here, ADB debugging and apps from unknown. So th this is pretty obvious, you want to do, uh, in case you want to install things that aren't in the app store, the, the Amazon app store, you want to select this so you can do that. So let's go ahead and do that, select it and say yes, okay. Now this top one here, I didn't, originally I didn't have it selected but when I was trying to add libraries to Kodi, um, it wouldn't let me. So I did this. So I'm assuming this um, allows you to see like hidden files and go down to the root and that kind of thing. So let's go ahead and make sure we select that also. So there you go. Both of those are on. Let's go back out of here now. All right. So now let's go ahead and go back to the home and let's go to apps. We're going to search for an app. In order to install it, we're going to need an app called um, AS Explorer. So let's go ahead and get that. Um, come down here to, uh, buh, 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 where is it? How do you search for it? Um, search for it. Oh, right here, there you go. Go to that search, right? So here's what we wanna search for, ES Explorer. So let's just type E, S. Things are gonna start popping up. All right, let's go ahead and do a little space. And E, right, there it is. So let's go ahead and go down there. We want to select that. All right, and there it is, very first one there. It's ES Explorer. We want to hit, go ahead and install that. All right, there we go. We're going to download it. Takes a little time, uh, depending on your Wi-Fi and your, you know, your network. But uh, definitely need this so you can go and install Cody. All right, so ES File Explorer has uh, completed, the, the install has completed, so let's go ahead and open it up. And what we want to do, we're going to use this to be able to browse to uh, Kodi TV and then download the Android app for it. So uh, let's go ahead and go to, we're going to add a favorite, we're going to add the, uh, the path to Kodi. So let's go ahead and put in the URL, H T T P. colon forward slash forward slash k o d i dot t v okay there it is so uh, http for our colon forward slash forward slash cody tv so let's go ahead and hit that and let's just call it whatever we want to call it i'm going to call it cody of course uh, buh, 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 D. Ah, there we go. And then hit next. All right, so there it is, URL and the name of it. So let's go ahead and move it over to add and say add. All right, so now over here on the left side, you can see all your favorites here. Let's go ahead and go down to the bottom. Right there it says Cody. Let's go ahead and select that. And there on the right-hand side, you can see the web browser has come up and it's bringing up the, uh, the web page for Cody. There it is. Let it finish uh, coming up there. There we go. <clears throat> now we want to go over to the downloads uh, menu item, right? Let's go ahead and go down to downloads. Oops, if I can click this right. 
there we go and it's kind of hard to see but it is highlighted the different things you can click are highlighted see if I'm moving it over there hopefully you can see that moving over let's go to downloads and hit select alrighty and we're gonna scroll down just a little bit let's see if we can get this going here where is my mouse there we go like I said it's a little tricky sometimes there we go we can see it hopefully there you go. You can hopefully see it coming up all right so we're gonna to go to the Android one which is here of course a little green little guy there we all know what the Android guy looks like <clears throat> and we're gonna select this one right here that says ARM so under the Android uh, link we're gonna click ARM so let's click that and at the top you can see it's spinning sometimes it takes a minute to uh, to start download you will see a, a little message here in a couple seconds Give it just a second. Sometime. There we go. And you can see it is downloading now. So we will wait for this to finish. All right. So as you can see, the download is success successful. Uh, it did download Kodi 16.1, that's the, uh, the APK for it, which is the Android version of it, which does go on Amazon, or, uh, yeah, the Fire Stick. So let's go ahead and say, uh, let's go ahead and open the file from right here, select that. We'll go ahead and install it right away. And it asks us what you want to do. Let's go ahead and install it. So click install. And we want to say yes, install. So go down and see down and over. Click install. As you can see, there it is installing. Not sure why that's uh, out of focus. There we go. Much better. I am filming this, filming my TV, so it's. You know, maybe it's trying to focus in the center instead of off to the side there. But uh, all right, we'll just sit here and wait for it to install. All right, really, really simple. What I'm going to do is, um, there you go, it says ready to launch right now. So let's do this. Let's go ahead and go down to done. We can't say open and there it is. But I'm going to say done. And let's get out of this. Right there there we go hit exit there we go and go ahead and hit the home button get out of this and you see our recent things there there is that we should be able to go down here to um, our apps and there you go you see in our apps library we now have Cody in there now a lot of people say that you have to it's kind of a pain to put a shortcut to it not at all not anymore it's there it will stay there so I don't understand uh, people saying that, but that shortcut is there and will stay there. As a matter of fact, what I like to do is go that and say add to favorites, just in case. It is one of my favorites. Um, so it's always there. So anyway, let's go ahead and uh, run it now. All right, and you can see that it's just that simple. Um, Cody is on there. Version, let's see how... Let's see if we can see the version number so we can, so I can tell you what version we got. Is it under settings? I think it's under system info. Um, buh, 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 buh. There we go. Android 5.1.1, of course, is what we're using. And they're down the bottom. Cody 16.1. Uh, the latest the latest and greatest version. So, yeah, really nothing, uh, nothing hard about installing it. Um, yeah. So real quick, the steps are on, on a brand new Kodi install, you can go and search for ES File Explorer, install that. You'll want to go to Favorites and add a favorite. And the favorite you want to add, you want to put the URL in of HTTP colon forward slash forward slash Kodi, K-O-D-I dot TV. Of course, it's going to ask you to name it, name it Kodi, and say OK. Then it's going to show it. Do you want to open up? You'll see there in your favorites. Scroll down to the bottom. You'll see Cody. Click that to open it up. You'll see the web page open up on the right-hand side of the screen. 
scroll over to downloads and then scroll over to the Android uh, section and go down to ARM select that after a couple seconds it will install and once it installs um, or I'm sorry actually I guess it downloads you'll then want to install it just click install boom nothing to it so hope this helps for all you uh, you, you uh, Amazon Fire Stick lovers uh, maybe I have a couple more videos on showing you how to uh, add libraries to this. Now, it is a little tricky because the file locations are not located in the same place, of course, that a, uh, a Windows uh, install is uh, because the Android file system is a little bit different. So, uh, yeah, so I'll show that. And, uh, yeah, any more questions, please let me know. All right, guys. Peace.